Okay guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, today we're going to be doing an unboxing of the Halo Best Mist and an assembling. So when you first open it, you can see you have all these like little boxes, which Brennan is going to be- I don't know if there's anything in them. Probably useless boxes. <laughs> I doubt they're just useless boxes, babe. You'd be surprised how they pack things. So this is the pattern of the- um... Useless box. Oh, okay. So there are boxes in here that are Useless boxes. Useless boxes. <laughs> okay, so we have some legs. Some... Okay. <laughs> okay, so that looks like... <laughs> Thank you. So this is the main compartment where she will sleep. The baby sleeping compartment. <laughs> the baby sleeping it compartment. Tucks yes. Tucks nicely under your bed. You don't <laughs> even hear the baby. I mean, don't put your baby under your bed. He's totally kidding, guys. Okay, we, we have, have instructions, provisions. but um, Brennan's not going to use them. <laughs> I assume. Oh, look how sweet. So we do have sheets for it. Um, they're oh, they need shit. to be washed. So. The Halo Fast Nest is known for the sides that collapse, but um, that. <laughs> um, there's even there's even like a little pocket over here that you can. We'll get to those, those those okay okay features. Okay okay moment, honey. okay. We have to finish this part. First. So we have this long box. <laughs> this is like the best unboxing video ever. Um. Okay. What are you cutting it with? Oh, okay. Do you want your keys in here? No, I guess not. More items. Okay. The metal so, nature. In this long box, I guess more leg. More leg leg items. Yeah, more leg items. Looks like support items. <laughs> yes. For the supporting. <laughs> we also have our dogs here who are watching so nicely their little sister's bed be put together. They would put a zip tie. <laughs> I have no idea what that part is. We actually might need those instructions. They, they would put a zip tie though. It does have an A on it. I know. Hope we don't break it. Oh my gosh, please don't. No, you know what? You have your keys right there. Can you no, use a key? No, honey, it's a zip tie. Oh, okay. Gotta either break it or cut it. Okay. Back momentarily. Okay. Brief intermission. We are back. Um, Brendan cut off the zip tie. I don't know what these things are, but I guess we'll find out. Probably tell you the size or something. Oh, okay. Yeah, probably. We have another leg. You're a leg. That one goes on the floor. I know that because that's what those things are for. That one. That's a floor one. That one. <laughs> it is a floor one. <laughs> Our dog is trying to help. Ace, what are you doing, bro? He really he, he just wants to help put together uh, his baby's sister's crib. Sure. Or he just wants to get in the way. Yeah, he does. <laughs> It's probably more likely. So um, now we see a Brendan trying to. Okay. <laughs> see, this is why he puts together things and not me because. This is the obvious. This part, part though, guys, is if you've never heard of the Halo Bassinet, this part is the part that can slide under your bed to bring the baby close to you in the middle of the night. So. That's a fun time. A little more. Operator. Okay, you have adjustable items here? Yeah, it's supposed to be able to, because it fits bed height, different bed heights. We probably need it on the highest, because we do have a pretty high bed. <laughs> Operator. Let's see what the... Back up a little bit, so I can get a better view. Picture. 
Okay. So this is what it looks like all together. And I mean, it's not too hard of an assembly, honestly. He's just gonna have to put the screws in and stuff after. Please excuse the mess over there. I'll probably have to cut that out. Eh, maybe not. We're in the middle of the house. Yeah, we are. Like, seriously? That's, um, why her nursery is going to be in here for right now. Oh, okay. So, that is what we have so far. So as you can see, it's like a super easy assembly um, from the get-go. Oh yeah, okay, I guess those do go. I think it's really cute though that it has it has like a little pocket. Click click. <laughs> it has a little pocket on the inside so that I can keep I don't know stuff in there I guess like I was saying before we do have sheets for this but um, they need to be washed so not going on there yet Ace, don't you want it? Hey! Excuse me. I said, don't you want it? Oh, and apparently, you can get all these little accessories to go with it. So you can get this little thing to hang on the side. This is not. Okay, like I was saying, we have these. We are, have to still get this. This is the mattress pad. Yeah, we still have to get that. So, that'll be another purchase. You can get a mobile, but I think that's kind of pointless, to be totally honest. Um, oh, you can get a newborn insert, which I think I'm just gonna put either the the snuggle me, the boppy in here. The I think it's like snuggle me organics or something like that, or I'll put the docata in there for when she first comes home. But we'll see about that. And then. Organic cut and cutter. So yeah. Brennan is figuring out how this weird part goes. Because on the instructions it says that these things are supposed to have letters on them, but they don't. So together in the factory they put the shit in roll. Put the shit in upside down. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, seriously. Okay. Because I noticed that because these little clips here were on the they were faced upwards where they clipped into. Oh. They're supposed to be faced on the bottom obviously so they could clip in. Right, right. So these assholes clipped in wrong. Should yeah that because that support bar should be on the bottom. It makes sense. a little bit more easy, a little easier. I don't know what I just said, but apparently it was some kind of words. More easy? Yeah. <laughs> So 
I guess that, oh, it would make sense for the little pouch to go on the outside. Is that going crazy? No, here's one right here. Oh, okay, yeah. And then one little pouch. Yeah, I know. Okay, so yeah, that would make more sense for that to go on the outside than the inside. So I guess, yeah, they just, they tucked it. They had it inside out. So if you're setting this up, know that. <laughs> Know that it's inside out. Sometimes people, yeah, unless they did it right in other people's fucking boxes. Yeah. Okay. So. We now have the bassinet part set up. And yes, it's supposed to look lopsided like that. What? This is supposed to be able to go up and down. This one. Yeah, side. yeah, okay, so. Oh, yep. Okay, Brennan got it. So that in the middle of the night, you can nice and easily scoop your baby up. But I've heard that some people actually prefer it to just stay up. But yeah, it's just a, it's just a pain in the head. You can't tell. Yeah. yeah. You can just honestly keep it unlocked. Yeah, that's what people do after the baby's born. Under. So, as you can see, the bassinet part is put together, making me so excited. For those of you who are new to my channel, I am currently almost 33 weeks pregnant, and this is the first thing we're putting together, so it's kind of a big deal for us. <laughs> Crazy lady. But don't worry, <laughs> Brendan will have to put lots of things together in the near future. That's really fun. <laughs> it's daddy's job. That's daddy's job. <laughs> yeah. So now he's just gonna put the screws in where they go. However, I, I wanna put them in. <laughs> Cause why would I put the pointy edge up? That makes sense. Yeah. Mm. Oh, wrong size screws. Uh. Hold on here. Okay, so that would make sense. So four screws go into these. Go like this. So the bigger ones with the red that, end. Those are that's called Loctite. 